and you know i and i did it and uh, it was pretty good everybody liked it and the food as well so i'm going to do it more often now and it also keeps you know like it also gives a lot of opportunities for uh, singer songwriters here as well as uh, local talent so uh, i think i'm going to keep doing it because not many venues here so and also i did a theater i curated a theater festival with because one of my friends from spain came barcelona and uh, they wanted to do a the, their show here so we were like we are organizing one so why don't we organize a festival so we kind of managed to we went around asking for sponsorship from so many people raised around 10000 dollars and did a theater theater festival and theater and dance festival and we were able to pay all the artists and everything yeah i have how was the smoking corner in the winter <laughs> It, it was, was oh there was there was uh, uh, my friend uh, Sal, she, she she would so so she would go out and smoke a lot there were only a yeah. few smokers it was it was kind of yeah. same as popular i'm sorry for it it wasn't <laughs> yeah, a, no i just wanted yeah it wasn't such a hot I, spot this after time. i came back from japan i quit smoking for four months then i recently started again uh, but i'm not drinking yeah, anymore why yeah I me too. I quit smoking. Oh, yeah, you quit smoking. Yes, because I have uh, I'm sick. I have uh, to see later. Oh, just oh, for a short you, you quit for a week. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but I didn't I didn't understand what were you saying? Sam. Me? About the smoking corner. Uh yeah, yeah. <laughs> It wasn't as popular during the winter time. No. no, it was cold. Yeah, it was cold. There were a couple of you know the same Scott members who would go there and smoke, but yeah, no, it, it was yeah just my friend so from China, and uh, Boomi from India would go a bit, but yeah, and Chris, Chris Daly every now and then. Would, <laughs> he, he, with the same packet he bought last <laughs> summer. <laughs> in, in, oh, in, what what about you, Michael? Do do you have any 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 burning questions for Sam? Yeah, sorry, uh, sorry, I'm joining late. Um, was it very very different, Sam? Uh, uh, yeah, I, I was talking to these guys because because it was hard for me to tell because I I trained so much, you know, between. Well, I exercised and and stretched a lot between last time and this time, just so I could, because I struggled so much against my own body last year. So so to do it this year, I was just wanting to get through it and sit through the training. But it definitely wasn't as sweaty. But but I think talking to these guys, I just think a big part of that is being in the white room as opposed to the black room a lot. Um, yeah, but definitely a different feeling, different trainers, less people as well. Like we had 22 people. Um, yeah, and Aki and Takamori son, like we're both wonderful. Like Ilan and Sebastian were both wonderful as well, but you know, they have their own kind of take, take on the Suzuki training and like, um, yeah, yeah, they, they would teach us like their own what, what their own kind of what what their focus kind of was or, or how they've kind of adapted the training was um yeah Aki and Takamori son kind of you know just just went through kind of I think what they do still with Scott but but it was still quite you know they're there at an advanced level like they would do the kind of sword training and things like Kiara was saying how uh, Sebastian's teaching um, the, the turnaround with the sword now, like we saw Mr. Suzuki in a electro rehearsal kind of yeah. stop. Um, Chika's Chiki, Chika, Chika, Chika son, and like make her during her monologue and kind of made her do exercises on stage, like 
because he wasn't really happy with where she was at that night and made her kind of do the sword exercise. Like one of the people like ran off and grabbed a sword and brought it for her and she had to do like these Suzuki exercises on stage. And um, and it, we were lucky that night because our friend uh, Kaza kind of could speak Japanese and then he was he tried to translate for us a bit after and, and the next time he kind of even brought a notebook and kind of took notes about what Mr. Suzuki was saying. So he, he kind of, he typed them all up for us and then translated and sent it all through to us. So, so we were really lucky that he kind of did all that for us. Um, he was very generous in, in doing all of that because they did that um, Q and A session as well. Um, mm. uh, and, and, uh, the one after kind of, one of the shows that we got to watch when Mr. Suzuki did like a, a thing, but it was all in Japanese and they were like, it's not going to be worth you watching. I don't, I don't know if you remember. Yes. But, but they did, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah they did that again. Yeah. But, but our friend Kaza went yeah. and watched and, and took notes for us all and kind of translated it all for us. So, so we were able to kind of read all that. Um, so he, he was, yeah, super generous. A Kaza? That was one of the participants. Yeah, yeah, his name was Kazuho, Kazuho, but he, but he, um, he came to us and he's like, "What, what, what would my nickname be in in English?" I'm like, "Oh, oh, Kaza." <laughs> so, and then he's like, "Yeah, that's great, Kaza." <laughs> and then the, our other friend Hideki, he, he came and he's like, "Please, what is my nickname?" I'm like, "Oh, well, Deki, of course." And he's like, "Yes." <laughs> so, so they were great. Um, yeah, lots of really good people, as there was in summer. Yeah, but the big news that the onsens onsens closing. Yeah, I heard. <laughs> Michael, <laughs> you're you're muted, Michael. Where? But yeah. not happening. Uh, why why is that happening? Did you say when? Well, we we went on. It was supposed to be closed when we went to the general public and we he just let us in because we came up the mountain. But apparently it's closed now. Like we, we went on the last day. He's like, okay, from now on. Oh my god. Allowed in. Yeah. So remember all the good times we had in that <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's just like Yeah. It was our salon. We yeah. just have the now in, in Toga. In 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 the in the in the in the center, I mean, yeah. where we where, where you come mm -hmm. where, is. Wow, uh, we jumped in the river. That was freezing. <laughs> we <laughs> jumped in the river during the during winter. Yeah, 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 yeah. Are you crazy? Yeah, yeah, we were. It was after the last <laughs> training day. We all went down there, and not all of us jumped in. But yeah. I I remember Christopher tagging us doing the tomorrow and tomorrow speech in Danish. <laughs> the Viking going into the, you know, mm. yeah. I would like That's, to yeah. hear from him, you know, like he, because mm. he went before and he was just with the companies and he was just training with the companies. And, yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, the other big kind of thing was, yeah, just that, like we did a lot of Presley. Which which is oh, like, it? yeah, yeah, yeah. Which you know we didn't even learn, but we we did that so much actually. Like, yeah, and really every day, kind of wanting us. Yeah, pretty much. Like once we'd learned it, we would do it every day. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So we do that, and and you know like. It's something that I, I never even clicked with, but it's, it's so obvious now that they said it. Because Aki and Takamori-san did a kind of Q&A for us, which was really great. Like, and we could just ask them whatever. We, we didn't get the chance with Mr. Suzuki, but, um, yeah, Aki and Takamori kind of sat down and did a Q&A with us. And someone was like, why are they called the basics? And it, it makes so much sense now, but it's just like, basic one is just moving your center to the side basic two is just moving 
forward and back and basic three is just turning the center so it's just three ways of just moving your center which i'm like oh yeah yeah of course it is yeah that is like that is that is good and yeah 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 basic two is forward and back up and up and down yeah and it's like it, it, it makes complete sense of course mm. But, um, mm. but i i just never it never clicked I have some questions. Go. Okay. Uh, okay. Be basic uh, questions. How was the food? It was different. Uh, no, it was pretty much. There, there were some dishes that we had in summer that we would have in winter. Um, the, the breakfasts were... We, we never had cornflakes or... <laughs> Yeah, it was pretty much always a cooked breakfast, like the sausages and the eggs. Yeah, no, no fish for breakfast. <laughs> yeah, it, yeah, but it was still great. Same, same kitchen staff. They, they were. Oh. It was was there any interesting. curry? The yeah. Japanese curry. Yeah, yeah, Ramit loved the curry. It was yeah, it was good. Ramit, yeah, Ramit loved the curry. Is it? Yeah, yeah. There was another <laughs> Indian student as well, right? Other than Rumi? Yeah, Bumi from West Bengal. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm hoping to go and work with them because she's got a theatre company and um, her family like has a theatre company. Her, her parent. So I'm hoping to go and work with them at some point. But yeah, if you're ever up that way, I'll hit, and then yeah. I have tell me contact. You, when you're going, I'll come there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What you say, Kiara? Sorry. I have another question uh, about the um, how do you say uh, a lot of the uh, rooms the rooms oh. uh, because when we went in the summer the COVID it was like I mean maybe worse so we were like everyone uh, in one room Mm. And it was like that, and if it was cold, no. So we were all in the uh, in the space that the men are at, where we trained. Like I can't, I can't, I still can't get the name of it. But we were in the Kali Kaliukan Kariukan Kali, in that um, big space. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we were up. The men were all upstairs. Uh, me and Jonathan shared a room. Kaza and um Aki, Aki Yumi shared a room so there were three people who had to share rooms but we were in the big rooms like uh that Pradit was in I don't know if you saw them with the bunk beds mm -hmm. so yeah. so I had one side and Jonathan had the other side so who like, had Michael's room who had Michael's oh, room Chris, Chris, had Chris had it Chris had okay. it oh <laughs> yeah, yeah so so it was like uh, boys and girls in the same space no, so the girls were downstairs in the downstairs room. Yeah, but, but there was in always... the same building. Same building, and and it, it wasn't cold. Like uh, it was all heated. Like it was cold outside, but if you didn't want to go outside, you, you didn't have to. You know, you could have stayed okay. the whole. Except Only to go if you and wanted to go, right? And it and Don't there the were two, <laughs> there were two different bathrooms. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so I didn't know yeah. there were two in the. Oh, I didn't know that either in that building. I didn't know there was two separate bathrooms. Yeah. Where, where we would go down the hall and go straight at the end, there was a left. And so the, our men's door bathroom was straight. And if you just turn left, there was another door. And that yeah. was, it's pretty much, yeah, it's exactly. I remember the same. seeing that. Yeah, because mm -hmm. the first day me and Ramada what arrived, we arrived one day early and, um, there was no one there, but the men's bathroom was playing up, so we had to use the women's bathroom that day. And exactly the same, they had like a um, you know, the 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 hot bath, the sento kind of bath, and showers, and yeah. So there were just two bathrooms. Um, yeah. Okay, I have another question. Actually, uh, the on. Scott was. Uh... The Scott was a rehearsing, so you had the chance to see rehearsals. Oh yes, yes, Electra, yes, yes, sorry, yes, we did, of course, Electra and Trojan women. 
Yeah, for the Those Olympics. Trojan women. Mm-hmm. I saw that. I saw the Trojan women in Budapest. Eh? Yes. It was I, just I like was... two nights ago, wasn't it? Well, it was like a few days ago, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. But uh, was it? I, I, it was the um, not as I expected. Mm-hmm. What, what, like the, the end, the end is very particular, very Suzuki style, very trash Suzuki. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> can, can, can I ask you something, Sam? Yeah, yeah, go on. You know, um, it was a, a very, very particular experience what we had in, in summer last year, uh, having the training and then leaving, leaving Toga, going to Kyoto. Um, mm-hmm. And it, it was a, a, certainly a very strange and unique time because it was the first time we, we all went in, in COVID times. Getting into into Japan was almost like getting into into the moon or getting into Mars. It was like a, mm-hmm. a very particular experience. Now, for you having that experience and now uh, coming back, leaving Toga again, um, how was that? Uh, it, it was very different, Rodrigo, because it, it was like we, we finished the training and the next day we left. Like it wasn't, we, we didn't have, because there was no festival, so, so mm. we didn't have the like three days at the end. And so it was quite, you know, and, and I always need a bit of time to kind of reflect on things. So it was really nice having that kind of three days at the end in Togo to kind of, so, so to leave so suddenly it was, I was still kind of really digesting and, and um, reflecting on everything. And then, so, so it, it was quite difficult for me to leave actually. It was, um, yeah, I, I wasn't, I didn't feel ready. <laughs> I would have loved to have stayed for, for another kind of few days just to kind of um, spend time, you know, and, you know, I, I didn't really get to, we were training the whole time we, you know we had one day off and we kind of went up to the onsen but even that evening we kind of had the q a and then i think we watched a rehearsal so you know i would have loved to have done a lot more walks and, and just spend some time in in the nature there and um, just decompress a little bit but yeah also i was lucky because i went to kenazawa with uh, uh mine and Pridget's friend remit because he was doing the Kuriatum workshop with um, the Potluck Theatre Company who, who were making the show the last year when we were there, that they would have lunch and they would eat with us a lot in the dining room. It's Risiko and Takeyuki and, um, yeah, yeah, all, all those guys. I don't know if you remember. They, they made the, the work with the cupboard split in half mm-hmm. um, when we went and looked at the, yeah, yeah. So so Pridget contacted them and Ramit was yeah lucky enough to be able to do this workshop. So it was great to be in Kanazawa to connect with those guys and to, to have a purpose for staying in Japan as well. Because like when I went back to Tokyo with um my friends uh, Ramit and Rian, it, it was very different because they're the, there are a lot more tourists. Like we we kind of went to Asakusa to the the temple that me and Frigid had visited. Do, do you remember that temple? That yeah. But this time it was just like so many people, and and it was quite overwhelming. Like tourists even, everywhere. Even, even though it was winter. Yeah, yeah, lots of people, man. So so I think we were we were very privileged to kind of go at the time we went to Kyoto and all, and all of us were very, very lucky people to experience the Japan that we experienced because many, many people have told us that the places that we went, we will have to book months in advance 
to just get yeah, in. Yeah, and I, I would have been really lucky to get the staff as well. It was a very unique experience what we experienced because it was, yeah, it was the Japan without tourists that it hasn't happened in, in a few years. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, and, and I think last time as well, I, I should have learned that, you know, after the Suzuki training, I, I just get so tired. <laughs> So it was like in T in Tokyo. It was good in Kanazawa because I had that purpose to be there. Like I was taking photos for the workshop, and but then in Tokyo, it was just kind of going to Shibuya and Shinjuku and all the places with my friends, which was great to see them kind of experience it for the first time. But I was just exhausted and just I, I was doing work. My company here is taking a show up north in Western Australia and in. At the start of May in, in two weeks, so we're um, uh, I was doing work in Tokyo, kind of trying to the the real world, the Perth world was starting to seep in, which which I had to get better at kind of being able to work here and while I'm doing international things. I I think it's a skill, Michael. I'm sure you're very aware of that. Yeah, um, big. It's a huge skill. I'm not the greatest traveler either, you know, I'm not, I'm not a great traveler at all. And, um, it always takes me an awful long time to recover. So, um, mm. uh, I've been getting better, but I know I still need, that's what was great about it for our time in Toga from my, my perspective is we had the time at the end of the training, which was a, perfect for me personally. I had time as well at the start. I had, you know, I came early so that was ideal for me just to get myself into this set, in, into the headset, and then at the end just to, just to recuperate. And it was it was wonderful being in Kyoto with you guys, and there was nobody else there. Like I was showing people yeah. of the of the palaces we were in, and they were saying, "There's no tourists." And I said, "Exactly, yeah, you know." I said, "Like that, it's not always full of tourists, you know." So we were so lucky. We were so so lucky. Yeah, I remember walking up through those orange gates and it was like, for, for stretches, me, you and Pradit would be the only three yeah. people walking and then we'd pass two people and it was incredible. How was that this time? Did you go to Kyoto? I, I, I didn't go to Kyoto. No, no, I just went to... Even in Kanazawa, it was very touristy. Uh, not so much, but, but no, not so much. Kan Kanazawa is a lot smaller. Um, but... Yeah, still a lot of people, but what about you know, Golden Guy? Yeah, yeah, so touristy, man. <laughs> yeah, <it's laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, like yeah, it wasn't yeah. even open, open, and there'd be people going down taking so many photographs, and we just kind of dodge people. Like, Did you go to Iraq, Middle East, and yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, because yeah. I, I you know, spend myself. your first day there, right? First night there, yeah, because I was there by myself, and I'm like. Yeah, you know, I have no friends in Tokyo you now, so so I just went for a walk. Just and she was just working, so I just went in and surprised did you, her. And, did you go to the jazz bar? No, because <laughs> it, it wasn't open the night that we were free, unfortunately. So we didn't get there. Um, how was how was with how was it with the uh, no masters Yoshi Sensei and yeah, so, so great. Yeah, it was great. Uh, yeah, this they, is our uh, no masters, you know, we had in our yeah, school. yeah, it yeah. was wonderful. Like, uh, uh Kawata sensei was in the Jutai for in the, the chorus the, that does the chanting, the, the singing for yeah, but uh, Yoshi sensei did a a, a shimai, a, a, a dance, and yeah, it was wonderful. Yeah, it was really good. And then we, yeah, we had dinner with them, and yeah, it was it was a really good dinner, and and it was like tiger time dinner. But Yoshi Sensei was drinking as well, and yeah, it was great. Like I think we drank a whole bottle of sake to us, so, you know, those big, like he just kept bringing it and bringing it, and it was it was a big night. Did you get to watch fun. Kabuki as well this time? No, 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 no. We didn't get to go that time. Um, no, we, we didn't watch. We watched a play by the Potluck guys. That was, that was great. Yeah. Risiko was, was really different this time, is it? Yeah. Yeah. That's really a, that's different. A, that's, yeah. 
we were really, yeah. we were really lucky as we Rodrigo was saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I, I told the other guys, but Michael, we did uh, like what one-legged statues. So that was another new thing that we didn't do. Oh, yeah, really? So, so, yeah, so you would just go, yeah, down. It was just like after doing down, middle, high quite a lot of times. And yeah, it was just like one one leg, yeah. But yeah, you start by lifting your left leg up and staying on your right leg, which was kind of counterintuitive to me. But but I mean, yeah, so you lift your left up to begin with and then back down and then up. Right back down. So so it was one leg enough. but also with the eyes closed. I yeah, yeah, when you go up, they would say, okay, close your eyes. Yeah. <laughs> how do you see, how do you do it with one leg? It, it must be very difficult, right? Mm -hmm. it, it, you know, it, it was especially actually, especially when you go down. Yeah, going down, I I yeah, had to try and I, I kind of cheated a little bit. I would kind of go straight down and then kind of put my leg out but to, to go faster. But yeah, to go right down, it was more difficult but yeah one leg was actually almost easier for me for some reason i don't know why i'm not sure when you find the the, the balance uh, i think you go yeah and i think i was able to pull everything in like pulling the knee up kind of i was able to bring like that into my center and kind of have my arms kind of shooting out to kind of yeah and and yeah it wasn't kind of, they were like, they were saying it wasn't really necessary to go right up on your tiptoes. It's kind of just raising your feet off the ground, which I would always try to get up on my tiptoes. So for statues, but they were saying, you know, you, you don't have to do that. But I, I don't know, maybe that's the aim, but yeah, you don't have to. But yeah, Presley, Presley was the big new thing, I think. And I know. I don't know which I can't remember which walk walks great, we did in summer. It would be great, Tom. If What's that? Sorry. Uh, um, if you can send us a video of what the press team. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I, I will send you a video. Oh, please I do. Mean, I've never. <laughs> I mean, I can, I, 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 I can show you quickly now. Like, if I make. Please, please, please. We have we have eight minutes. Go for it. Okay, okay, okay. So so you 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 start like start feet together, yeah, and then you go up on a right leg and down and up and down. So so that's just that movement that we the sawtooth movement that we would do, right? But yep. then you go back, up, down, up, down, and then just back and forwards like that. And then at a certain point in the song, you come up and down to the right. No, so right leg up and cross over, but then your right leg comes back up and then you stomp and you go forwards. Then left leg comes up, left crosses over, left up, stomp, and you just carry forwards until a certain point in the song. And then your right leg comes up again. Um, so right leg up, down, and then up again, but then you stomp backwards. And then you do the same, going, going backwards. Da, 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 da. And then it gets to a certain point in the song, and then you just return. Yeah, certain point in the song, and then you stomp feet together, and then you just return to this movement. Da, 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 no and wonder it's all you were long. doing this for a long day. Yeah. It seems like a lot that, of practice. But it's super fast. And the hard da, thing is to, da, da, to stop. Da, 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 da. Yeah. So you, so you have to stop each movement. And you're supposed to, and, and everybody would keep, like even when they were showing us, like that they would get like, oh, because um, Kaori-san and um, Ogawa-san, the, the two uh, ladies who, who were in Electra, who were two of the nurses, do, do you remember Kaori and... Yeah, um, yeah, 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 yeah. Th they would train with us in the mornings, so so they would do the demonstrations, and with Fernando and Antonina and Aki. But even them, like they would come up, up, and they would kind of just put 
like I'm exaggerating, like they would just put their leg out. But you're, you're supposed to get over your center over both legs, but it's so the movement's so fast, and like the difficulty for a lot of people and for me as well would would be to like to stop here, stop here, stop here, stop here. Like people, like everybody would just kind of like flow it into one because it would, but you have to stop, 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 stop. And, you know, Aki would say that, she'd like, stop, 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 stop. I mean, and yeah, it was a... Uh, how was Aki? Was she gentle as well, like Takumori san, or was she like, like bang on? She, uh, yeah, she, she had a gentle business to her. She 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 um <laughs> she she yeah yeah and and you know when Mr Suzuki was supposed to be coming in the next day or when when he was supposed to be coming in you know he, everything would lift in the room um like always but, like always yeah like always um no she she was. But she she would like joke with us as well, and she she would you know often say like you know I I know it's hard like you know she was lovely in in kind of um yeah 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 they they were wonderful it was really nice hey, yeah so I'm I'm just figuring it out that um we have four more minutes and, oh. um. I think we 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 have. I have to leave now. And, and I and I mean, right now here is yeah. midnight, but I think over there must be around eleven. And um, ten, ten. I Maybe. think I just really uh, would like to thank you so much for taking this time and answering our questions and being so lovely as always with a big smile. And uh, oh, it's yeah. just so nice to see you all. Yeah. yeah, no, the, the Japanese style. Absolutely like beautiful, and thank, thank, thank you so much. I, I think this. this thank you for been... sorting it out, Rodrigo. No, absolutely. I yeah. think this, this should continue. Hopefully, other people that have experienced the training in in the same way as you can join another time. But, but uh this, this, what you have, a, a, what you have shared. Uh, for me specifically, has has bring some uh, some light, some some we call it in Spanish, el protocolo de levedad, that it means the protocol of liveness. So I think it, it brings some some questions nice. in order to bring into the cloud. We say, um, so, mm. so yeah, thank you, thank you so much for being so open for this and to share your experience. It's been absolutely beautiful. Yeah, thanks, man. Hey, I'm thinking of maybe coming to Melbourne next year. I, I'm, yeah, we'll chat further. But I'm, I'm thinking of maybe applying for masters at uh, BCA. But I, I'm tossing up between BCA and NIDA in Sydney. So, but absolutely. maybe I'll see you. If you come to Melbourne, yeah, you're, you're, you have place to stay. you're gonna study you're again, Sam. Thank you. Man, it's hard. I'm writing just funding application after funding application. I just want to do theater without having to fucking I know. I know. money. Ever. I hear you. I hear you. I hear you loud and clear. I hear you. I hear you. Yeah. yeah. Well, well, um, but because I have this space, um, in two months, I'm traveling to back home to El Salvador, and I'll be I'll be giving workshops. Uh, in the biomechanics and um, also, uh, I'll be giving them I've been a part of a program of uh, Melbourne a independent theater company of of a of a dramaturgy because my show was was a um, was a, a it was selected was selected to be part of that so congratulations yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's been a very good good year, very busy. But if you want to go to El Salvador, we will be training biomechanics, Suzuki, and Asian uh, shamanic trance dance in front of the beach. 
in a new theater. Oh man! Wow, that would be fantastic. Wow. So what please, a dream. Please, please sounds so. Please come to yeah, sounds in, like in a dream. July. In July, I'm in Atene. Or August. Lucky you. Okay. You'll be where? In Atene. Um, there's a office in Athens. Oh yeah. For the yeah. uh, workshop, uh, Tersopolis workshop. Yeah, Kiara, I want to talk to you. Yeah, after. Sam, yeah. let's go for that next year. We have, we but have, you will be studying. Listen, a minute. You'll be studying. We, we say all goodbye. Love, love to all, love to all of you, and we'll see okay. each other again. Bye. Love you all. Yeah, let's just bye. chat sometimes. Thank bye. you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Muchas gracias. Muchas gracias. Bye.